Hi. Um, it's Otter again. If you're new, go subscribe. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, um, Gaining Root Arden. It's an awesome channel. Okay, so I did a jump rope video when I was in third grade, and now I'm in fourth grade. And uh, in third grade, I was in a jump rope club where you were trying to make it on the jump rope team. And in third grade, I made it, and I haven't been able to do a video on correcting some of the stuff I did wrong. So the first thing I did wrong was the double under. I'll show you how I used to do it. And this is my continuous. So let me show you how it's really supposed to go. Okay, I'm not gonna do it too much. Cause I don't wanna get too tired. <laughs> so that's the double under. Then, I learned a lot more stuff, so can can, I figured out how to fix it, I thought it was like that, <laughs> oh gosh, I thought it was like that, like, cause I didn't really know what it was, cause it was on level two, not little, level one, and I am now on level three, so, um, yeah, okay, I'll show you the backwards stuff later. Oh gosh, <laughs> the carpet. It's like this. <laughs> I, I, I don't want to do it in here because I have so much space, but I can do it because I passed it. Um. Yeah, you're doing it in a small space. We are in our apartment because it's cold and getting dark because it's in the middle of winter. So. Yeah, and it's 451. So. But this is how the can can's supposed to go. <laughs> I'll show you something I learned, um, was it yesterday? Yeah, yesterday, when I was at practice. So, these are called quarter turns. They're actually kind of hard, but easy at the same time. So it's like this. Oh, I can't do it, there's so much space. I'll try it again. There's so little space. This one, I had a lot of trouble on if passing on level two. It's the behind the back cross. This was the very last thing I had to pass to be on level three. It's really hard. So this is a non-continuous progression. <laughs> that happened a lot. That's why I had so much of a problem. <laughs> but that's non-continuous. Now let's see. Continuous. Oh. <laughs> oh gosh, that was hard. <laughs> um, this is the leg over. Oh gosh, <laughs> I stepped on the jump rope. It was like between my toes. <laughs> I'll do a video when it's lighter out and not so cold. Yeah. And then it'll be easier. I can do it. <laughs> I know you can do it. I've seen you. Yeah. Just if that bookshelf was fun. There's one literally right there. Yeah. I'll scooch back a little bit. See if that helps. You see, it always does that. <laughs> Yay. So you saw me do one. And then how you get out of it is you go like this. So yeah, then there's the pretzel, which is a lot like it, but instead of going like this and jumping, you have to go like this and jumping. I'll show you. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> but ballet has helped jump rope 
and jump rope has helped that way. Because in jump rope, it's supposed to go like this. In a ballet, you know, everything's on a tippy toes. So, <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna try it again. show you something else. This is the side swing cross. See, I don't really have enough room for it, but I'll try it <laughs> anyway. See, it keeps hitting that. But, okay, one more time. <laughs> Continuous would be like this. Like, check it out. The rope is hard. Little space. Get to the rope. Um, it would be like this. Like, you'd switch arms. And then I'll show you the big button. So, when you run, most people go like this. Like, when you're doing jump over and running. But I, I messed up. <laughs> They do, do it like this, but it's supposed to be like this. And if you do it really fast, it's like the double under. So this is scary, but oh gosh, that's why it's scary. It welts you. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to do continuous double under, so I say goodbye. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, I hope you like the video. Make sure you subscribe. If you can hear me, this is loud. <laughs> 